Let's go, dude. Here's to wiping the daily dumpster fire crew off the map. All right, hit me up. I love the fact I get representation in this game. You're not even a real communist. That's rich coming from a traitor like you. It stands to reason he's the untrustworthy Alpha Legion. No, he's right. You're all real communists. Wait, why can we hear you? I thought we were supposed to have separate Discord servers so we can coordinate. What's the matter? Can't beat us without hiding? That's rich coming from you, Debate Dodger. Can we just get back to the game? I'd rather focus on the more pertinent space politics of 40K. I'm just surprised you're joining us, Matt. I thought you looked down on gamers. I had a change of heart when our staff told me I can play as witch hunters that burn heretics and infidels at the stake. Yeah, but, but it's the demon hunters that can build actual witch-burning pyres. Then why are you playing as them? I chose the faction that has the most glorious-looking gothic architecture, who also doesn't suck at killing demons. Sorry, that would be mine. Michael, you're playing the most generic faction in this game. Even if you're using a Black Templar skin, they aren't anything to write home about. Uh, and you're just an Elder Zeno. And I'm just your boss. I can be Zeno if I want. Damn, got him. They're right. Let's finish off the other team first. Now who's the dubious traitors? We would have had them infighting had you kept your mouth shut. Relax, Destiny. We can take them. See, Destiny? Matt's Adeptus Arbites are no match for my more numerous crew and stealth suits. I don't know how you expected riot police to fare when they are outnumbered and underfunded. Right now my Templars are a bit preoccupied fending off Destiny and his fellow fence-sitters, but I'll help when and where I can. What do you mean, fence-sitters? Logic led me to what I believe. That's debatable. Guys, please, I just want to play a match without this devolving into another shouting match. Yeah, I'd rather just play. It's not every day we get to 4v4. Funny you say that because I see Ben isn't playing around. He's already got a decent defense in front of a relic. An elder player won't be as challenging without his allies. Would anyone be willing to help me push into their bases? I'm keeping my strike force at my gate until it's ready. Looks like I found Andrew Clavin's base. I wonder if I can take him out seeing how lightly defended it seems. You may have greater numbers, Shazo Kolinsky, but your feral anarchists are no match for my well-trained knights in shining armor. On second thought, I should wait until I have some anti-armor units to back up the crew. Otherwise, those gray knights will tear them to shreds. Don't worry, Kyle. I'm coming to help. Destiny, Hassan, you gonna help take these guys out or what? Gotcha, fam. You take out Clavin. I'll take out Matt. Ben, is there, is there a reason you're building something in front of my base? I'm going to put some webway gates near your bases so I can teleport my troops to wherever you need help. Thanks. It's much appreciated. Looks like Ben's army is on the other side of the map. Now's a good time to attack their bases. Just keep in mind, the Eldar can build portals that let them quickly travel from one place to another. He might have his troops at the bottom, but if he has gates there and at Clavin's base... You guys will have to fight them. Dude, this is not fair. Why is it the Eldar can build and use webway gates, but not the Dark Eldar? I guess it's a testament to the fact that a faction of depraved degenerates can't build anything that lasts. Looks like I found one. This is why I brought a detector with me. The Dark Elder degenerates are trying to take me and Andrew out. Ben, Michael, can you lend us a helping hand? The Kami cosplayers destroyed the one webway gate I had there. It could take a while for my troops to get there. Looks like Matt Walsh's real women are no match for my gender-fluid Dark Eldar warriors. Don't get ahead of yourself, Jenks nephew. My sea of real women are holding the line the way you wish they'd hold your dick. Finally, my aspect warriors are almost there. Next time I'll hide the gates better than how our presidents handle classified documents. Kyle, please, we need your help. Use that army you have sitting at the bridge and attack. Too late, Vosh. Your army is already mincemeat now. Yeah, me, Michael, Andrew, and Matt are thick as thieves. You're not breaking our united defense. Oh, what? You guys were so in character before talking about witch hunts and xenos and shit. Now suddenly you're letting your boss show you who's your sugar daddy? Hey, Vouch, remember the time you got banned from Twitch for provoking them into banning you for using racial slurs? It was only a temporary ban. They like me and Hassan. We can do what we want. Yeah, Twitch doesn't mind them making racial slurs as long as they allow Twitch to continue packing their fudge. Guys, can we not? Hey, don't knock it till you try it, Ben. I wouldn't be surprised if Ben Shapiro's raging homophobia is a case of Haggard's law. Destiny, I'm straighter than the pole your wife dances on. Yeah, there's no way you'd know that unless you watch her. It's okay if you do, Ben. I can't blame you. Wait, aren't you guys supposed to be goody religious prudes? What happened to all that dogma? It's okay when we do it. Now I see why nobody invites us to their Discord matchmaking events. Next time I think I'll just do a 1v1 against Kyle. At least we can keep this civil and related to the game we are playing. Never thought I'd find myself agreeing with Andrew Clavin of all people, but yeah, I am not a huge fan of us talking politics when this is supposed to be our downtime. Cowards. Vosh, if everyone else would rather have another match like this, you've got the rest of the crew to do it with. But I'm not interested in my work life following me after hours. Let me see if I can sneak a webway gate into Kyle's base. Since he's the Tau, he shouldn't have any turrets for me to worry about. Really, Ben? You're that brazen? Eh, it was worth a shot. Well, he didn't have any turrets besides his listening posts. 
Just really bad timing. This is not good. I lost three-fourths of my army already. My army got completely wiped out. Well, you are playing as the Imperial Guard after all. Guardsmen aren't adequately equipped to fight the Grey Knights. Since I can't build webway portals the way Ben can, I think we all should pull back and concentrate what's left of our defenses at the gates. Sounds like a plan. I've got tanks and sentinels being produced to compensate for my guardsmen being more fragile than our opponent's masculinity. I guess your insults have to compensate for your impending immolation. Don't you know what we witch hunters do to heathens like you? What did you expect? We're on opposite teams, just like we're on opposite sides of the aisle. Yeah, I know. I'm just getting in character. Who knew all you had to do to make a gamer out of Matt was let him live out his crusader fantasy? Look at what he's up against. Any reasonable conservative would. Sorry, there's no such thing as a reasonable conservative. Oh, great. Not this shit again. Kyle, you're supposed to be on our side. Stop being the enlightened centrist and grow a spine already. Destiny, you're like the last person to tell anyone to pick a side, Mr. Alpha Legionnaire. Come on, not you too, Kyle. Don't worry, after this match is over, we won't have to worry about our colleagues affecting our monetization. Anyway, Ben, I haven't seen your forces in a while. Are you going to help Matt and I push into their bases? I'm working on a vehicle strike force of Vipers, Wraith Lords, and Fire Prisms to augment my Aspect Warrior army. Just try to hang tight until they get there. While you guys head for the main gate, I'm going to flank Kyle from the top. Andrew, you might not want to say that out loud. We're all in the same Discord channel, remember? Didn't matter. I saw his Grey Knights poking out of the fog of war. Still, this voice channel isn't the best place to tell your teammates what your strategy is. What are you talking about? It's been a great idea. Too late. Lesson learned already. Well, there goes that. I got to say, Hassan, you were right about these Eldar raids being a problem. Luckily, Chaos has plenty of units and buildings that can detect infiltrators. I believe the only Eldar units that can use the infiltrate ability are their rangers, and Ben can only build one squad of those. Kyle, did you really just use an orbital bombardment inside your base? I was desperate to kill his Grey Knights, but yeah, in retrospect that wasn't well thought out of me. I can't believe I got you to do that. Now your buildings are going to be weakened until I can get some melt gun wielding stormtroopers to swing by and finish you off. Damn, who knew Andrew Clavin would be the skilled RTS Daily Wire player? Oh, here we go, Matt. These are the witch-burning pyres I was talking about earlier. If you played as the demon hunters instead of the witch hunters, you could be the one using these. At least my buildings are better looking than yours. They may be better textured, but they don't look realistic. Says the Space Marine player. Guys, as your employer, I command you to stop bickering and work together. Infighting is for leftists. Relax, Ben. We're just playing around. Yeah, Ben, loosen up. I'm not playing around. I'm always dead serious all the time. I will round up all the witches and burn them at the stake like a bright candle burning through a sea of darkness. You always were a kidder, Matt. Isn't the phrase, you always were a kidder, Steve? Yeah, because you are on the same moral plane as Kurt Kistler. So much for monetizing this video, I guess. I gotta learn to stop recording games I play with you guys. Clavin's right. I'll be the better man and not respond to what Matt said. Oh, how cute. Finally, you admit you're a pep- Is what I would do if I was a better man, you hypocritical fascist white sneako who advocates for impregnating 16-year-old girls? Ha, I knew he'd come around. Okay, I'll admit Destiny really had me going there. Disagreeing on politics with you guys isn't the same as refusing to defend myself. Yes, it is. All of you shut up or get a room and make love already. Anyway, it looks like we've broke their defenses, but I think we need to either get more tanks or get more anti-armor units now that they are throwing vehicles at us like no tomorrow. The Dark Eldar may be more underwhelming than I would have liked, but at least their flying snipers can still dish it out. Your snipers may do more damage, but my vehicles can wreck buildings, especially ones that can't turn invisible. Okay, guys, for real, Michael and I are having trouble taking out Vosh and Kyle. Yeah, the left is actually dangerous when they stop their internecine infighting and form a cohesive force. How many times do we have to teach you this lesson, old man? Until we win. I can move my defenses far easier than you can flank me. And my artillery can exercise Kyle Zenos from my base without worry of him retaliating with any units that can threaten me. Oh crap, Ben's army just came out of nowhere. This is bad, I didn't prepare a defense for this. I don't think you could have. The Dark Eldar aren't exactly a well-rounded faction. Well, I do still have a few tricks up my sleeve I can still use against you. I don't think Screams of the Damned or that Soul Storm are going to be enough to stop him. I'll try and get some Defilers and Raptors down there. Destiny, didn't you learn from Clavin's mistake to not announce your battle plans out loud? Hey, thanks for putting a hit on your reinforcements, Destiny. Well, it is Destiny after all, and it's not out of character for either him or the Alpha Legion. Now, Vosh, it was an accident. Cut out your conspiracy theories and do something other than defending only your gate. Come with me, Vosh. Help me do something about Matt's base. Kyle, Ben and Michael are about to kill us off. Attacking Matt isn't doing anything. Your attack isn't going to survive long enough in a fight against me and Matt. Well, there goes my army. Vosh, can you lend a helping hand? Oh, I don't know, Kyle. Maybe after you show some loyalty to your fellow leftists instead of trying to fence it. 
Vosh, please don't do this right now. We're on the verge of losing Hassan. Your Wraith Lord walkers are no match for my floating scorpions, Benny boy. They will be when you have no troops or vehicles to support them the way I have. Yep. I should have kept my forces at the gate instead of helping you, Kyle. This will be the last match I play with you. Damn, dude. I really don't know how to play as the Dark Eldar. Hopefully Destiny will fare better. Sorry, Hassan. It doesn't look like things are going well for either of us. Well, that's it. I'm out of the match. That's what I get for choosing the Dark Eldar. Yeah, I think I screwed this up. I'm going back to playing Stardew Valley. I can see we're pretty much screwed, Kyle. Do what you want after this. I'll go back to watching Commissar Reb's presidents play videos. What do you say, Kyle? Want to see if you can beat me one versus one? I'm down. No confounding variables of other players interfering. 